Ready to build your own AI-powered podcast generator? In this series, we'll create a complete service from scratch using cutting-edge AI tools like Suno's Bark Model and Hugging Face, powered by Python and Nitric. By the end, you'll have a cloud-deployed podcast generator optimized for GPU performance. Let's get started. In this first video, we'll focus on setting up the project, installing dependencies, and understanding the structure. By the end, you'll have a solid foundation to build the rest of your AI podcasting service. Here's a sneak peek at what's possible with our AI podcast project. I'm your host, Reggie. And today we're talking about something that sounds like it's straight out of a dystopian sci-fi novel, The Dead Internet Theory. That's just a glimpse of the potential. Let's get started. For this project, you'll need the Nitrix CLI for running the app locally and building and deploying our services, Docker for containerized environments, Python for development, and an AWS account if you plan to deploy your application to the cloud. So to start, we'll create our Python project using Nitrix. Let's run Nitrix new and select the UV Python template. This template sets up a minimal Python project for scalable cloud-ready services. Once the project is created, let's open it up in your editor. Here I'm using VS Code. The next step is to install dependencies. Let's run the UV sync command to install the template's base dependencies. Then add the libraries we'll use for AI-powered podcast generation. Hugging Face Hub for modal access. Torch and Transformers for machine learning, and Sci-Fi for numerical computing. We'll add these dependencies to the ML optional group to keep them separate, installing them only in containers that need them. So let's explore the project structure. Let's take a look at the Nitric YAML file. This file defines the structure of our project, including its name, services, and configuration. In our project, services are located in the services folder. Nitric uses a glob pattern to match these services with their corresponding directories. There's also a start command that runs the project locally with Python, ensuring a smooth development experience. When deploying, the Python runtime points to this Docker file, guaranteeing that our application runs consistently in any environment, whether locally or in the cloud. Let's take a quick look at our PyProject TOML file. It defines the Python UV starter project with core dependencies like Nitric, optional ML dependencies, Sci-Fi, Torch, and Transformers, and finally Watchdog for development tasks. And that's it for setting up the project. You now have a Python project configured for local development and ready to evolve into a fully AI-powered podcasting service. In the next video, we'll create the core resources for our project. See you in the next one.